Bitcoin Death Cross Price Prediction 2021. Welcome back, guys. It's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video, guys, we'll explain to you what a death cross is. There's lots of misconception. You know, people on social media and Twitter and Facebook, Reddit, people are saying if a death cross happens, Bitcoin is going to 1K. It's like, you know, death cross hits and Bitcoin drops. It doesn't happen like that. In this video, guys, I'll explain to you exactly what death cross is. And more importantly, guys, I'll share with you how we are trading it. You know, making these predictions, you know, death cross is a laggard indicator. Once you you sell a death cross price is already down you know 60 percent from the top so it's a very laggard indicator you have to be careful you know when all these conversations coming in you know people talk about sell when it's a death cross it's more important is understanding what the market is saying looking at what's going on in the overall market having a trade plan knowing when to buy or knowing when to sell i'll explain to you exactly how we're trading this dip in the rockstar trading group if you have been watching the youtube channel i've shared with you exact buys and you know when the dips happen they have amazing opportunity to buy so we'll be sharing with you all that good stuff in the video so make sure you watch the video till the end so death cross in simple term is death cross occurs when a short time frame moving average typically the 50 day slow moving average it crosses over the major long term moving average which is the 200 day moving average so what i have done in a, these are two indicators i do have on my chart uh, so this is my normal chart i have it I have it kind of light, so they're slightly different. So I've created a simple chart to explain to you when previous death crosses happened, what happened to the price. One happened in 2018, one happened in 2014, and what we can expect here. I'll share with you if I think death cross is going to happen, share with you if I think the top is in, and more importantly, like I said, unlike other YouTube channels, I'll share with you exactly where we're looking to buy and sell. You know, it's really important, guys, you have a strategy, you know, that if you, whether you want to follow our strategy, I'll leave the links below if you're interested for like live streams, courses, uh, telegram group where I'm posting exactly how I'm trading and all that good stuff. You can try less for a month. There's a special offer to try less for less than 40 bucks to see if it's for you or not. But if you're not guys, you can, you know, make sure you have your own strategy because if you don't have a strategy, you trade with emotions, you'll end up selling the bottom and buying the top and no one wants to do that. So uh, that's what a death cross is. If a 50, typ typically the 50 day moving average crosses over the 200 day moving average, we can see it in the stock market charts and uh, we can see seen examples of a facebook chart as well this is a really good example this happened and you know people could have been like you know we've seen a death cross let's sell or we're going to zero or whatever it literally made it went up to new all-time highs and then this death cross happened and price dump so you know death cross isn't be all and end all like i said it's a very laggard indicator it's a lagging indicator bitcoin price has already dumped from the top about 50 60 percent so, you know, we shouldn't just be saying Bitcoin is dumping. Even if you sell, you're selling after it's already dumped 50%. You know, you can sell a pullback towards here, you know, once it already goes up. You don't want to be selling. We actually bought the dip. You know, I'll share with you where we bought. I posted exactly when we were buying. This was the second dip we bought at 30 cap. bought another one slightly higher. You can see there. And I was posting exactly, bought another dip. Now just wait. And then it pumped about 50% uh, uh, Bitcoin from that dip. And we sold half on the 50%. And if Bitcoin dips again, and I'll share with you the exact level how we're trading it. But you know, that's how you trade. So make sure you, you know, differentiate trading and you know this price prediction analysis. Analysis, anyone can do analysis, but trading is a whole different ball game. So that's what the death cross is, and I've explained to you that it's not a gospel. If death cross happen, it doesn't mean you know it's a bear market, we're going to 10k or you know 5k. Some people are calling that. That's not how it works. So this is a Bitcoin chart. This uh, this ch this chart has the longest history in Bitcoin chart. You know, I'm gonna ignore the 2012 there was you know 200 moving average it was just starting up the main death cross we saw was in 2014 so this happened the price was around five to five it's crazy to think that even i wasn't involved in in bitcoin then uh, bitcoin dumped to a, almost a low of 150 let me pull that up a bit yeah around 70 uh, percent uh, drop since that death cross happened but the price did move up a bit you know it went up about 40 percent even after the death cross and then we dumped about 70 percent and once we started the bull market we didn't have any death any death crosses until we hit march 24 uh, 2018 and uh, that's what that was you know the almost the start of another bear market the reason why i said it's a laggard indicator is see how it's already dumped 50 percent from the top so you're not really selling the top it's really important to sell pullbacks here and this is what i'm going to be looking to do and i'll share with you how we're trading uh, uh bitcoin i could be wrong guys i shared that dip by ended up being one of my best trading days but, you know i could be wrong as well I, I tried to you know i was bearish on this pullback 
uh, where is this i was bearish on this pullback i shorted bitcoin and then this is when we started longing and this has been you know one of my best years last year was my best year of trading just longing leverage trading bitcoin again go watch the youtube videos the facebook live streams the uh, rockstar trading group post i posted exactly how we traded it so then guys uh, bitcoin dipped around 66 percent since that bear cross happened and we dipped to around three thousand dollars so this both these bear, bear uh, death crosses uh, cause significant dip uh, in bitcoin bitcoin death cross hasn't happened yet if bitcoin you know comes in to 46k and then it starts breaking down into new lows i think the death cross could be happening in june july time this will be quite bearish if it does happen we don't want to be seeing that but even without the indicators you know that just looking at the chart the, the where i will be looking to short bitcoin if bitcoin bounces so the dip buys i bought i sold half if bitcoin comes into you know 50 48 k's and starts rejecting in this level guys i would be looking to sell bitcoin and if Bitcoin, so again, I, I, I've talked about the death cross. I'm just sharing with you from a price point of view what we will be doing. If Bitcoin comes into here, rejects and breaks down, whether it is the death cross or not, that is a very, very bearish signal. And I would be looking to sell potentially short Bitcoin. If Bitcoin, guys, has a death cross, you know, has it just has a death cross and then starts breaking out above 60K, you know, I'm going to be looking to buy. I don't care, you know, death cross happened, Bitcoin's breaking out. If you go back and look at the Facebook chart, you know, death cross happened, but Bitcoin, it, Facebook is breaking out above 190 in new highs. You buy it then. So whether the death cross happens or not, if Bitcoin starts breaking out above 60K, I'm going to look to buy. So that's a buy signal. If Bitcoin dips into 20K, whether it's a death cross or not, I'm going to buy it at least for a bounce. I think Bitcoin is going to bounce if it hits 20K. It's a very, very big level. That's a very similar dip buying opportunity like that these opportunities are like an opportunity of a lifetime when you get to buy these positions and now i'll be waiting at my desk if i get an opportunity and i'll post exactly uh, when uh, in the group when it happens so that those are the, those are how i'm looking to trade it the question is is the top in in my opinion if you study the bitcoin tops i don't think bitcoin has topped out bitcoin usually tops out with a spike you know we saw a spike here we saw a big spike there uh, we saw you know back here as well we saw a similar spike bitcoin usually don't top like this and then breaks down which is what we're seeing now so in my opinion if you ask me where we are uh, i think bitcoin is something similar to this you know almost a death cross happened but then bitcoin started breaking out into new highs and you know had a new high then we get the proper death cross so so I expect, again, this is not, I've told you how I'm going to trade it, where I'm going to buy, where I'm going to sell. You know, I'm not trading my opinions. I'm not saying we're going to a new high. I'm, I'm just all in Bitcoin. I'll be looking to trade it here. There's always trade setups. If your prediction happens, if, if it gives me trade setups, as long as the, if my prediction is right, I'm not going to make money. If, it, if my prediction is right and it gives me a trade setup, we use a pullback setup in the Roxa Trading Group, a very simple strategy, market structure break and pullbacks. If I get that setup here and my prediction is correct, I'm going to long Bitcoin into 80,090K and potentially you know, the Holy Grail 100K. I'll be definitely selling some spot bags as well if it hits 100K. That's, that's how I'm going to trade it and that's how I see Bitcoin going so overall guys death cross is just a simple pattern people look for it's not gospel don't sell all your bitcoin if, if we get a death cross it's more important having plans what we will do what will you do if bitcoin gets to 10k what will you do if bitcoin gets to 20k what will you do if bitcoin starts breaking down have a plan don't be like you know scared when something happens have a plan beforehand again i've shared all my plans in the group and i've shared some in the video as well you know how i'm going to trade it write those down and if that happens follow the plan if you're wrong on your plan review it and make a plan for next time and that's how you grow your wealth that's how you know i might be wrong in this move but i know i'm gonna get more right i've back tested my strategy over 10 15 years in oil especially that's where i back tested my strategy this four hour pullback strategy and i know that if i you know even if i get this wrong long time frame i will make money and guys i want to end it on this note bitcoin price short time frame price is driven by emotions you know elon musk is tweeting negative things there's lots of other you know tweets and people are saying bearish and bullish that's driven by you know china bank banning bitcoin that's driven by short time frame long time frame price guys is driven by fundamentals and if you believe in bitcoin if you believe in what bitcoin is to i i'm massively bullish on bitcoin the short time frame prices those are buying opportunities you know i one of my best trade is buying bitcoin you know 5k 4k people were calling me a scammer saying bitcoin is going to zero i'm wrong i was down 25 percent but those buys ended up being you know the best trades of my life so these dips if we do get another dip again if it sets up i'm going to look to buy this dip 
and again i'll be happy for this because i've got cash i've been selling 40k 50k 60k and i always take profit so if you do get a dip you can look to buy so i'll end it on that note short time frame price are driven by fomo emotions and you know social media and all that you know emotions long time frame is fundamentals and if you believe in bitcoin you know you can pump it i massively believe in bitcoin i think bitcoin whether it goes to you know 20k 10k i think bitcoin will go a lot higher and you can watch my previous videos i think i made a video just buy one dollar bitcoin last year year uh, and you can watch that video i explained to you fundamentally why i'm bullish on bitcoin so thank you very much for watching this video to end the video guys what is your thoughts on bitcoin are you bullish bearish comment below your price predictions also if you're interested in the rockstar trading group i'll leave the links below for you to check out so thank you very much smash that like button if you've enjoyed the video subscribe to the channel if you've enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys soon with another great video go bitcoin